Looks like they have the Chromecast in stock. Let's take it home and try it out. Hey, Lego my ego. So let's open the sucker up. So there's clear instructions on how to install it. All you gotta do is plug it in, turn it on, and set it up. So it tells us to go to chromecast.com slash setup. So let's go to Chrome. We'll load that up. All right, so here we go. Let's get just started. So just install Chromecast and open it up. Then you click on devices and it needs setup. So it's 4252 four, setup. So it finds the device right away. You just click on it and you set it up. Then just hit done, set network, and it'll connect to your network. With a Chromecast, you can turn your dumb TV into a smart TV. Big thick cables are a thing of the past. Let's take a look at all the things it can do. So on the Chromecast, you can put any video up onto the TV screen. All you gotta do, if you have ES File Explorer, just open that up, and then try to play that movie. Click on it and go more. And then once you go, click on it and go more on the bottom corner, go to Chromecast. And then it'll ask you if you want to install the Chromecast plugin. You go yes. Install the plugin for ES File Explorer once it's installed. So go back to ES File Explorer. And now with that plugin and ES File Explorer, you can play any video you want on the TV. Let's turn up the sound and see how it works. Oh yeah. So there you go, you can play any video file you want, it doesn't have to be on Netflix or anything. Here's the memory card with the DVR file that I just recorded. You just plug that in and you can play directly off that card onto Chromecast. So any video file on your thumb drives or anything you plug into your phone, you can just click on it. Oh, you can't play it in VLC. VLC doesn't have that functionality yet. So you hold on to it, click on more and click on Chromecast and it'll throw it up onto your TV screen. So this new Chromecast is very powerful because it can stream video up onto your screen from any device. Frame rate's pretty good, quality is pretty good too. So as you can see there's a little lag but it's not too bad considering how good of a quality video it's streaming. You can actually watch the TV and play. The lag is good enough that you can play Need for Speed on there, which is pretty impressive. So there you go, that's a quick demo of how well the Chromecast 2 works with the live streaming mode. You can play Need for Speed which means any 1080p video from your phone will work just fine. So in the screen mirroring mode, it's pretty fast as you can see. Click on any pictures you want, flip through them. What goes up on the screen is a representation of your phone, so you turn it sideways, it goes sideways. It's pretty silly, but that's the way it works. Oh, let's play Angry Birds. Everyone likes Angry Birds. So, as you can see here, you can play on your phone. Oh, that's a crappy shot. So, as you can see here, you can play on your phone and it goes up on the screen pretty quickly. So play on your living room or whatever it's called. And buffer is pretty quick. You can set your volume on here.
Chromecast connects at 1080p and the video quality depends on your Wi-Fi connection so it'll try to bring it up to 1080p but if it can't it'll just play it at 720 or whatever it's going to play it at. A wire along the top edge, the A pillar down around the side. Looking for one because it's really well you can even watch it's movies on your phone video. and do anything you want while well, casting exactly. to the TV because the Chromecast is doing all the work up there. Also for Google Chrome on a PC, all you gotta do is search for the Chromecast or Chrome on Windows. You add the extension, it's the first link. You just click on here. Click right there. Google Cast extension. And then you click on the install button. And then once it installs within 20 seconds, you can go to your videos, click on any video in YouTube. If you're looking for the most powerful light ever, you can the right YouTube video. If you're looking for a light that's practical, has a good runtime, doesn't get super hot to the touch, and doesn't consume batteries like a madman, then you're at the wrong video. But if you're looking for a flashlight that's enough to blow your mind... And then, it'll show up up here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to double the power output of the Skyray King 7x XML2 LED button. Anything that can load up on Google Chrome browser can be casted up onto the Chromecast. So here's Daily Motion, just around the video, and it'll play. So that's how easily you can cast things from a PC and your Android phone onto the new Chromecast 2. It's definitely a lot faster than the old Chromecast and it can do a lot more things. Basically anything on your screen can be put up on your big screen. So there you go. That's the Chromecast in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. I hope that helps.